nickel metal hydride battery chargers. Any comprehensive discussion of nickel metal hydride battery must also consider the purchase and use of a corresponding battery charger. As it turns out, this is a complicated subject because it is so easy to damage batteries during the charging process. I like to divide the available nickel metal hydride battery chargers into three categories as follows. One of three dumb consumer grade chargers like this one. These are simple, inexpensive devices of the type that are often bundled with packages of batteries and they are often or generally marketed by the battery manufacturers. They are not smart. They generally can hold any hold and charge several batteries, but they don't have any way to display this detailed status of any individual cell. At best, you may see a single LED light for each cell indicating that something is consuming charge current here. But although they are completely capable of charging your batteries, it is very easy to damage those batteries if you're not careful. For example, if you just leave a full set of batteries in one of these chargers for a week or so during hot weather where room temperature gets above 90 degrees Fahrenheit or so, it's very likely that your batteries will get so hot that they will be damaged or destroyed. In your hot garage or your hot outdoor tool shed, they will damage or destroy your batteries even faster. If you're going to use one of these chargers, you should keep it in an air conditioned room and you should set a timer to remind you to remove the battery after a few hours. You'll want to consult the uh, charger's instructions to determine about how long that, that would take and interpret that information very, very conservatively. You don't want to burn out your batteries with one of these. A second type, type two of three, I, I call my smart consumer grade charges, chargers. These are microprocessor based chargers with some kind of a display associated with each cell being charged. Like their dumb cousins, these devices can generally hold and charge several cells all at the same time. Unlike their dumb cousins, each cell will have an individual display or display area, which will let you know approximately how much time remains before the charge cycle is complete. These chargers should also try, try to detect batteries that are improperly installed, overcharged, or damaged, and the displays should clearly reveal these conditions. The best of these chargers should also include some kind of a trickle charge or maintenance mode that will try to keep a set of cells fully charged without overheating. The third type, smart industrial grade chargers are my favorites. These are also microprocessor based with multiple cells and multiple displays and a superset of the functions of those smart consumer grade chargers. Unlike those consumer grade chargers, that we just discussed, these are calibrated using industry standard measurement units and criteria and they reveal more detailed information about the individual cells. The information is displayed in engineering language, electrical potential in volts, electrical power in milliamps, and electrical energy in milliwatt hours according to long-standing conventions of the electrical engineering community. This information allows the operator to analyze and record the actual performance and capacity of each and every cell. Using this information, each cell can be labeled and problematic cells can be discarded before they contribute to equipment failure or damage of companion cells. These devices should include automatic temperature sensing and automatic cutoff in the event of excessive heat. And here's the dirty little secret. Battery manufacturers have little or no incentive to produce any kind of effective smart chargers. They'll sell far more batteries and make far more money if their consumers try to get by with the dumb little chargers they sell because most consumers will, will end up damaging their batteries with them long before the advertised 1,000 or more recharge cycles are ever used up. If you only take one bit of advice from this publication, let it be this. Don't get your battery charger from the companies that make most of their money selling batteries. More segments of this video clip are available at www.askmrwizard.com in our electricity section. This video clip comes from a large collection of related clips. All are indexed and easy to find on our website, along with text articles, illustrations, and forums. Please visit us today. www.askmrwizard.com, your technology magazine online.